Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Day in the Life of a DoorDash Driver. I just had my seven o'clock breakfast, my lazy man's breakfast because I didn't feel like cooking. And now it's about 8 a.m. Now it's not very busy in the morning for a DoorDash. I go to the gym every other day and as much as I really just don't feel like going today, there's no excuses. Every other day means every other day. So to live up to my word and kill some time before I go out dashing, let's go to the gym. We're here, the Big Apple. All right, let's get in there. These gains aren't gonna make themselves. Good morning. Now it's time to go ahead and make my lunch. So for lunch, we have some chicken and asparagus made in some olive oil, a baked potato with cheese, and then some good old reliable halo top just for the extra calories. And this shit's so good. <laughs> that was me, cause the food was so good. First order is subbies, let's get in there. Um, looks like there's a drink on there too. There's a drink on there too. Okay. Bro. All right. Thank you. Okay, with hour one coming to a close, I'm now at fourteen dollars, which is really bad. I'm gonna go ahead and launch up Uber Eats now as well. I don't usually turn them on, but uh, it wants me to take a picture of myself. Let me take my sunglasses off. Hi, sisters. Sorry, I thought maybe the CEO of Uber might have been watching, seeing my camera. I wanted to make sure uh, I looked good for him. Come on, pick up. Um, yeah, for a Kyra. Kyra. Thank you. Wow, guys, Uber Eats really paid off. You know, look at this this amazing offer I just got. I mean, thanks, Biden. Ten dollars, seven miles, not a bad offer at all. And it turned into $11.75. We are pretty far out though, so let's get back into town. Okay, I'm a fish. I'm not a fish, what the hell? <laughs> okay, I'm a fish. Time ticks by. Oh, I stutter so much while I'm trying to record. Two hours in right now and I'm at 32.76, which is a little better, but isn't great. I'll catch you at my next order. I'm picking up a DoorDash for Emily. Hippity hoppity, get off of my property. I like it. Excuse me. <laughs> Wait, hold on, pause this clip. What the hell are you laughing at, huh? What's funny? Look, they weren't laughing, I walked in. <laughs> Did I smell bad? Did I have a booger in my nose? I'd like to think these ladies were laughing because they've never seen such a handsome young man like myself. Possibly they saw the huge bulge in my pants and they knew I was packing and they were laughing out of nervousness because they've never seen such a huge dong. I'm not really sure, I'm just making assumptions. <laughs> Um, this is my DoorDash order. It looks like there's a drink on there as well. Okay. Got it. Thank you, you too. Thank you. If I didn't remind people, I don't think I would ever get a drink. Part-time DoorDasher, part-time drink checker. Now, before you call me a criminal for where I set that bag, her instructions did say set on the hood of a Kia Soul. That vehicle is so ugly, but that's besides the point. So I did do what she asked. It did feel illegal though. Thank you. Have a good day. Sheesh, that's a whole lot of food. Fucking barely fits in my DoorDash bag, bruh. Damn! Clip that for the thumbnail. It's probably not the thumbnail. I do care, but this is pretty heavy. So. Okay, thank there you. you. Have a great day. You too. 11.25 for just a few miles, not bad. All right, guys, we are exactly four hours in with four hours to go. Halfway through the shift is 66.26. Not bad, not great either. Let's try to finish tonight with a bang. I got this McDonald's. Let's go ahead and get in there. That voice. Awesome, thank you. Man, why does every apartment smell like weed? I mean, it's every single time. Next up, we have this KFC stack. I'm sick of KFC. I'm sick of seeing Colonel Sanders. I, I swore on the day that I went to every KFC in Kentucky, that I would never step foot in a KFC again, but I went back on my word. I folded for that $13 bill. Disappointed in myself. Good, how are you doing? Awesome. 
Thank you very much. Yep. You have a great day. You too, man. Thank you. Okay, next up, two really good orders. Neither are KFC, so I'm pretty happy about that. But damn, look at this one and the next one. Both have the potential to be more. Really, really solid. Okay, so I declined this order right here. As you can see on screen, it's really bad. But I guess the app is mad at me. It won't go away. Like it just keeps saying unexpected error and it just, it's still there. I tried resetting the app and it's still there. <laughs> what the hell? I know it's hard to tell because the lighting sucks, but yeah, it's, it's still there. The mileage is just changing the closer I get to the McDonald's. I'm not gonna take it. It's still doing it. It's just changing the mileage the farther away I get. After nearly 10 minutes of resetting the app and waiting for this order to disappear, it finally did go away just to show me that I was paused the entire time and the order wasn't even there. This app is awesome. What the fuck is this guy ordering? The whole menu? Hi, Reese, can I help you? Hi, uh, I'm just picking up a DoorDash for Corey. Pull around. Thank you. Alrighty, last order, 675. So there is about 20 minutes left of my shift, but I'm gonna go ahead and end it now. I'm pretty damn far from home anyways. 145.76 for just under eight hours. Plus I had a 30 minute lunch break in there, but we won't even count it. We'll say seven hours, 45 minutes. Huh? Huh? Not bad. All right, I have, I've had like a massive headache for the past five hours, so I'm gonna head home. Maybe I'm dehydrated, maybe I need to eat. I don't know. But since I'm done with my shift, I'm gonna go ahead and head home. Here's the numbers for the nerds out there. So it's gonna be on screen now. Not a bad day by any means. For those looking at these numbers right now, that's really cool. Um, for those of you who aren't though, and we're just having a little talking session right now, um, you should go down below and subscribe because that would be even cooler. I came home and did some really nice cooking, you know, some home cooking, better than Betty Crocker herself, honestly, and I didn't really record much else. It's just me in the bathtub eating pizza, what do you want? I mean, I think I took a shit at some point too. I, I can't even really remember, this was yesterday. If you guys like this video, make sure to drop a like and I'll see you guys next time, dash on. This pizza's good.